Well, I want to turn now to that deadly mass shooting in Richmond, Virginia. A 19-year-old man accused of opening fire outside a high school graduation appeared in court today. Now, he is now facing murder charges as one family member grieves the loss of a father and son who was one of the graduates. ABC's Justin Finch is tracking the developments from Washington. What should have been cheers for the graduating class of Huguenot High School instead turning to screams as gunfire sent terrified students and their families scrambling for cover. <laughs> Police arriving within 45 seconds to a theater near Virginia Commonwealth University in Richmond where the graduation was held. Authorities later confirming two people were gunned down. 18-year-old student Sean Jackson and his stepfather Renzo Smith, both shot and killed. Sean's mother telling ABC News her family was there to celebrate his graduation. Sean's nine-year-old sister, also a victim, recovering in a wheelchair after being hit by a car while fleeing the area. One witness describing how the joy of those gathered quickly turned to grief. I walked past this guy and he ran and the next thing I know he was shot. It was total, total chaos. Setting multiple units to the area, all traffic stand by. Authorities say five others suffered gunshot wounds. Officials say a 19-year-old suspect is in custody, facing two second-degree murder charges with possibly more to follow. We believe there must be accountability for this violence. Police say multiple handguns were found at the scene and believe the shooting was targeted. I'm tired of seeing people get shot. The Richmond School District is canceling all graduation ceremonies until further notice. The Gun Violence Archive says so far this year, there have been 279 mass shootings. Justin Finch, ABC News, Washington.